Hi game players of History 1 I'm going to demonstrate how to navigate World 1 and complete it in order to access World 2 and 3 When I talk about the world, I mean the clickable maps that you will find in the game player section in uh, front of the course uh, page or the course site so this is world 1 this is world 2 and this is world 3 <coughs> if you click on world 2 or world 3 without completing the previous worlds what would happen is this it would say that you must complete the following conditions in world 2 etc. lesson before you can proceed so go back to the course page by clicking on history 1 2 2011 and then click on world 1 okay so this is bansa world or nation in uh, it's in filipino so what we see here is that we're g we are uh, oriented on mission 1 where we play the role of a time traveling student of history okay so uh, below the instruction is you will find a couple of buttons that will take you to different activities for this mission and then there is a scroll bar here I'm um, sorry there is a uh, progress bar uh, that presents uh, how uh, what you have completed so as you can see here I have uh, actually completed a significant portion of world one and uh, I'm only I only need to complete a few more the red uh, part here so you can click on this like for instance create your cover story which is the first thing that you did by presenting your avatar uh, if you click on uh, the link to the discussion forum you will be taken out of the world and taken and you're going to go to the uh, f uh, forum so in order to go back to the world uh, the world one you either click on back here in your uh, browser on your browser or you'll have to do it over again actually you can you can uh, uh, leave the world and then go back to it again but you need to uh, go over it again by going to the course page once more and then clicking world one map then you're taken back to the so you have to sort of uh, cycle through it every time you uh, leave the world so when you click on this let's say form a guild that's mission one do not confuse mission one with world one world one is composed of three missions so go back and then let's say you did the biography here if you want you can always right click and open that to create a new tab so that you don't miss your place okay so this is the Filipino biographies uh, synthesis we have, uh, I posted a, some rubrics to guide you in discussing that and then what happens here is that uh, take note that there are more instructions to the activity in the world than in the course guide so here you can see after doing investigate Pinoy's which is the Filipino synthesis of the Filipino bi biography activity it says next mission so if you click on that it will take you to mission 2 there will be an introduction and then it says here 
mine sources. This is the source activity, source criticism activity that you can find here. Okay, so right click and then see. Okay, sources in recent history. And then we have Pantayong Pananaw, another branch. Okay. So that is merely part of the source criticism because parts of mission 2. So you can go back to mine sources. And then next mission, you're taken to mission 3. So this is where now we're going to do some training. Uh, so if you click on training for instance, it will discuss the uh, instructions for creating the historical narrative okay. which you will submit in your guild uh, in your guilds forum okay. so after training you go to planning okay. plan so here we have uh, instructions for the uh, Scrum 2 project and then after you have a plan based on the historical narratives you click on raid okay. so uh, the first raid will be done of course outside this world because you have to create a public publicly viewable uh, interpretation of history okay, so you select an audience and then you, you uh, consolidate all your narratives and come up with a uh, digital multimedia project a blog a video etc that is publicly available so that your audience can see it and criticize it so after this it says here clear mission free okay so at the end of mission free there is a text box and it says reflect on what you have accomplished this is what you need in order to complete world one so let's say I will just put here a dummy set of text my reflection set I click on please and please enter your an answer in the box and then it says congratulations end of lesson reach so this means that you can now access okay now uh, ignore the grade that is not important uh, your XP's will be granted based on evaluation of your submitted work uh, rather than the completion of this world or the completion of this lesson um, so I'm going to be looking at your reflection later on now you if you want to proceed earlier than your guild and do the solo work in world 2 you can put a dummy uh, a dummy page or a dummy uh, reflection paper and then I think you you are allowed to edit that again later on but you have to go through the world one all over again so after this ignore view grades just return to history one 2.02 .02. and now you can access world two okay so that's about it I hope the uh, this clarifies a lot of uh, problems with uh, that some people are having so remember there's a difference between mission and world usually there are actually there are free missions for every world now to check your XP's just uh, in a, go to grades it, it probably doesn't say administration in your view okay just click on grades 
and you will find all the uh, activities that are granted XP now there are three columns here the items and then you have grade these are the XP's and then you have range now ignore range I could not remove it Some, there's a bug in the program so that's not supposed to be there just look at grades and what would happen is after I have uh, assessed or evaluated your submission I am going to manually grade you and then your XP will appear here along with your total and once you have a total you go to the uh, front page then select game rules and then check your total XP against the levels to find out what level you are in and what the uh, equivalent grade would be okay so it's about it hope this helps Oh.